This is story time number 10, so listen up. She tried to soul tie me. Now, when I say she tried, I mean she did her best. She did her best. She did what she could. She did a good job. And for you guys that don't know what a soul tie is, basically, it's these girls that <clears throat> try to get their way with you through sex. Like, try to get you hooked to them. They'll use sex as manipulation. And they basically want your soul. When you have sex with a person, it's not what you think, bro. It's bigger than what you think is what it is. That's what it is. You guys are sharing. You guys are exchanging energies. You will be attached to the girl you have sex with, bro. Whether you think so or not, you will think about this girl. You're going to be thinking about the girl you had sex with for quite some time. I don't care who it was with. You will. It'll be on your mind every single day for a long time afterwards. That's why these girls like to get you with the soul tie shit. They like to use that as their number one form of manipulation. Now, this past Valentine's that just passed by. I knew there was going to be a lot of single ladies at the club that night. I took my old red bottle of wine, had a couple snaps off her, went to the club and that was that. There's lots of girls there that night. Pretty good night there. And that shit happened, bro. I got what I asked for, I guess. The fact of the matter is, I was extremely smart with it. That's the thing. You see, I know these bitches, bro. This girl did a whole lot of things to try to hype me up to make me feel as good as I could possibly feel. And I appreciated every compliment I got. Don't get me wrong on that. But I didn't take it in to the point where I'm letting her feed my own ego and I'm liking her more and more because of it. That's what she tried to do, for sure. Thanks. And just nothing after that, you know what I mean? Just thanks. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, you got nice color eyes. I love your eye color. Mm-hmm. Thanks. Thanks. You got a nice ass. Thanks. <laughs> thanks. And other things as well. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> but, uh, this is what these bitches do, man. And they're damn fucking good at it. Some of them girls are extremely smart. And they know when they get a high caliber guy, that's exactly what they're gonna do. Because honestly, they fear losing that high caliber guy. So they'll do everything in their power to get him hooked, to get him attached. Through these words that they use, compliments plus sex, plus performing the best that they can possibly perform for you. I knew exactly what I was doing with this girl, bro. It was nothing to me. I walked into that bitch like a pimp. Didn't care at all. She knew that, dude. She knew that. I could feel that energy of her. Her, her telling me, you're, you're bad, aren't you? Right before I'm walking at the door, before I'm about to leave. I can tell you, you're a little bit bad at least. You're a bad guy, aren't you? You're a little bit bad. No, 
Nope. No, I'm not. Not at all. I'm just me. I'm not good and I'm not bad. I'm just me. That's it. I know what she was doing, bro. I know what she was doing. Trying to get a, a whole lot out of me. You know what I'm saying? And I fucking left that bitch, bro. Stay the night. No. Mm -mm. I drove my ass back home in the middle of the night. And guess who got a text a day and a half later? Yep. Shit. <clears throat> and I'm not even going to go any further into detail about that because I already did a video on this whole situation. If you guys want the full story of what I'm talking about right now, go back to my videos. Watch story time number nine, I believe. If it's not story time number nine, it's story time number eight. But check number nine first. It is called The Wedding Dress. Story time number nine, The Wedding Dress. Full story. From this night and experience that I've had. If you want to watch it, that's up to you guys. I think he'd be entertained by that video. But anyway, this is what these girls do, man. This is what they do. And they are not bad at it. They are good at it. They are damn near experts. Some are better than some, but they're all at least a little bit good, and some are great. And a lot of, like, I got. I got nailed by these girls when I was younger, bro. The hottest ones, too. Time and time and time and time again, and I'm telling you right now from my experience, it is not worth it, bro. If you're gonna do anything, if you're gonna get the job done, have it in your mind of what you want it to be. Don't let her get into your mind. That's the, that's the number one thing you don't do. As long as you don't do that, you are fine. Don't let no bitch get in your head. Because that's where she wants to get. She wants you to think about her. They're doing everything in their power. So you will think about them on a day-to-day -day basis. That feeds their ego. They want to feel important. And when you don't give them that, bro, honestly, they're going to be chasing you. They're going to see you as, this guy's high caliber. This guy ain't to be fucked with. This guy's hard. This guy's got his shit straight. That's the first things that come to their mind, bro. Like, this is a real dude. This guy ain't desperate. He must be talking to other girls. He must be doing other shit. This guy must have options. You know what I'm saying? And it's true. You just don't let any girl's soul tie you, bro. That's what you don't do. Because they don't just want to get you with sex. They want to get in your head as well. They want you to think about them. They want you to want a relationship with them so they can toy you around and do whatever they want to do with you and make you into their puppet. She says jump, you say how high. Don't let her get in your head. Stay in your lane. If, she, if you're going to go out with a girl, if you're going to go out to a club, if you're going to go to a party, and a girl comes up to you there, you go out to a girl, you start talking to a girl, any which way. She's gonna start playing games with you instantly. Even if you don't think so, yes, she is, bro. This is what they do. They wanna see where they can take you. 
That's what they want to do. The things you should be thinking about in your head is how you want this night to go. You're going to get what you want out of her. And that's it. You don't fall into her games. You don't do what she tells you to do. You don't bend over backwards for this girl. That's it, bro. Do what you want with the girl and move on with your life. Leave the area, wherever you're at. Everything's good. Nothing, nothing, nothing happened. Just like nothing happened. That's the best thing you can do. And I'm going to end this video right there. Don't forget to like my shit. Comment, subscribe. Until next time, I'm out.